Hey guys, it's me, Savvy Maggie, and yes, I have on the same t-shirt because you guys know I work in black, and this shirt is just a work shirt. So I am, let me turn the car off. I'm going to roll these windows down. Nope, nope, this is a truck going by, so I guess I should it. I am having some Panda Express, and I did not order this. Look at this. See, I hate when they mess your food up. This is stupid. I did not say Crab Rango. I didn't ask for Crab Rango. I asked for uh, veggie rolls. I didn't ask for no dang old Crab Rango. So I'm about to eat it. I will. Mm. Because I just feel like going back around. Mm. And I have to go back to work, guys. So I'm just taking a little lunch break. So I guess I have some crab rangoon. <laughs> Check that out. It's good. It's hot. So. I'm going to lower my back windows a little bit. Not too much. And I have some orange chicken, some chow mein, and what else do I have? Some, um, crunk chicken. I don't think you guys can see it too well. Oh, and I also got some, um, ooh, walnut shrimp. <gasps> oh, Lord, please don't let me make a mess. So the one that's shrimp, you guys want the first bite? I'm taking it. <laughs> I didn't even attempt to try to record at the shop today. That's just not happening. It's the hair salon, okay? It's loud, oh well. Mm. That's good. Panda Express, even though it's not authentic Chinese, is like one of the only Chinese restaurants that I will go to anymore. And eat actual food. If I go to like a local one, I don't eat the food. I'll get like maybe some soup, some rice, noodles. I don't get any, any type of type of meat from them. Now for a chicken wing. Mm. So how's your day been going, guys? I've had a pretty uneventful day, which is okay with me. The water shrimp is pretty good. Mm. Now, if I had got them as an entree, probably wouldn't even even been good probably even wouldn't have even been good mm -mm -mm. so yeah I was on YouTube yesterday and I'm scrolling I'm just going through the stories and I get to one that says finally Calvin Hunter and Wendy Williams filed for divorce. And I thought to myself, wow, that is deep right there. Because what's deep to me was the finally part. The heck do you mean finally they filed for divorce? 
I mean, you know. I've stated how I feel about it before. I think it's crazy, but it's her marriage. And people kill me knowing about stuff for years and putting up with it. But as soon as it becomes public knowledge, you're more worried about being embarrassed publicly than your marriage. I don't want to say that's what she gets for always being in people's business, but I guess it does come to territory because who knows how long their marriage has really been in name only. You know what I'm saying? But to make the statement, finally they're getting a divorce, is a lot. Because it's not really our business that they're divorcing or staying together. If she chose to stay with her husband, oh well, that's on her. That's not our relationship. So, I don't think it's right to bully a person into a divorce either. <laughs> you know. And you may not feel like she's being bullied, but kind of, sort of. But I'm not like that. If I want to do something, I want to do it. If I wanted to stay with my husband, no matter how many people knew what he was doing, if I agreed to it, you know, I mean, if I knew about it and I chose to, to accept it, oh, well, that's what I chose to do. That's one thing I like about Will and Jada. They keep people out of their business, honey. And you might think you're in it right now, but guess what? You'll be out of it real soon. Okay. <laughs> she's finally getting a divorce. I thought that was a lot of nerve. <laughs> mm -mm -mm. This is good today, y'all. Uh, fresh. doing something that I love to do, which is people watch. I like to people watch, you guys. I like to watch traffic. Don't know why I always have. But I've always liked to watch people ride by in their cars and just see what they're doing. Mm, this is so good. But I'm not going to lie, I'm so full. And I need to stop here because I have to go back to work so I can't get sleepy, y'all. I know the ice is about to kick in. Woo. Mm. This is good. And I'm glad I got the chow mein because sometimes that rice can be dry. I was like, let me pull it over and eat because I'm going to eat my food while it's hot. I kind of wish I had gone back around for my veggie rolls. But, oh well. Oh well. Maybe next time.
I really did not need the dairy and the crab rangoon. Yeah. Oh, it's so pretty. It's such a beautiful day. Spring has finally sprung. The new year has finally come in. <laughs> I feel like, man, I believe this is the true new year. Spring. The first day of spring to me has always been like New Year's Day, guys, because it's spring. It's like everything is popping new. I don't even see why we have New Year in January. Oh, my goodness. Cold. Everything's dead. There's no new life in anything, right? So, yeah, yeah, that just tripped me out with the finally they're getting divorced like excuse me who the hell do y'all think y'all are to send these people to divorce court that woman has been knowing her husband had another woman okay y'all in their business sure you don't know what she's got going on <laughs> oh, excuse me we just be up in everybody's house <laughs> everybody's business boy oh boy I know it's, you know, people like information, people like, we like gossip, but I think we can take it too far. I think we do. You know, because people just go digging, 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 calling hospitals and all kinds of, it's just too much. You know, maybe I'm just getting older. I don't know. I just still, you know. I told y'all before in another video, like, I missed the intrigue of Hollywood. I missed that intrigue. You know, you had something to, like, really look forward to and people to be fans of. You can't even really be a fan of anyone anymore because you know their personal business. So it's not about the music. It's not about the acting. So you feel like you know these people. <laughs> I am full, y'all, and I got to go back to work. Ugh. But I just have one more person. Quick and easy. No chemicals, no nothing like that. Quick and easy. And I'm out. I'm going to go and pick Paige up because she's still at my cousin's house. And she hasn't called me all day, right? Excuse me, y'all. She's doing the, um, you know, you don't call me, I won't call you thing. She did that yesterday. And I thought it was so funny, so I called her and I said, well, excuse me, why haven't I heard from you all day? And she just started to laugh. I said, oh, you figured if you didn't call me, you know, I wouldn't call you? She's like, I knew you were going to call me. You know it. So, you know, she said she wanted to stay another night. I let her go because her bag was pretty full when she left, so I knew she had packed. Excuse me, for a couple of days. And you guys know they were on spring break this week. We didn't have anything planned. For spring break I had I kept saying we're gonna do this we're gonna do that we never worked out a plan and the next thing you know spring break was upon us so she has been hanging with my cousins my cousin has a few children so they're her favorite cousins and they're actually the only cousin's house that she goes over to so they're over there having them some good cousin fun <laughs> Good teenage fun. I'm sure they've done 30,000 videos with the same thing on dance moves like all these kids do. But, you know, they're staying out of trouble having fun. So that's okay with me. Oh, gosh. I'm tired, y'all. But I got to go back to work. So I'm going to get on out of here. I'm going to sign off this video. Thanks for watching Savvy TV. And I'll see you guys in the next video. I love you guys for real. Bye-bye.